How's everyone doing out there? Uh, this is about New Year's resolutions because I know everybody's building up and getting riled up because it's about to be the new year, which can be exciting, can also be overwhelming, blah, blah, blah. It can be a lot of things depending on your situation. But today I'm speci specifically talking about strength training, weight loss goals, all, all, all encompassing of that subject. So maybe you're overweight, you've been slacking all year, you've been over consuming calories, you haven't been walking, you haven't been strength training, you haven't been getting enough protein. Almost everybody knows what to do in the age of information. So I'm not gonna dive too deep into that. I do in my other videos, but not in this video. I'm just gonna give everybody the benefit that they intuitively or they, they've researched online they know what to do they know what actions they need to take they just haven't implemented them they have kids they got pregnancy they got sick uh, they're unmotivated they're tired they work long hours right you fill in the blank with whatever i'm not saying the excuses are good or bad it just is what it is it's a very common occurrence that people put everything off and then new years they try to make an extreme decision to change everything and that's why it's so unsuccessful because the analogy I use or I, I'm going to use now is imagine you're going the wrong way on the road and you just pull the e-brake and just flip around like it's not sustainable you're gonna crash or, or you're gonna fucking flip you know something bad is gonna happen so you just, you want to come to a gradual stop, right? You want to slowly apply the brakes. You want to find the nearest exit and then you want to whip around. And that's a great analogy for, for doing anything that pertains to health. Like just start taking more steps and start at the beginning of, start at any time, like start immediately, like start today, start today, like on your lunch break, go walk. After you eat breakfast, go walk for 10 minutes. Just walk for 10 minutes and do that every single day. Like, I don't care what you say, you can figure out to walk 10 minutes after you walk, right? Or 10 minutes after you eat. You can find a way to walk 10 minutes after you eat and you get the compound interest of that all year. So the point being is take small steps. Take small steps and the small things add up over time, it's called compound interest. It applies to financial investing as well. And you can utilize that to your advantage. Don't try to be like, okay, the new year's coming. I'm gonna run three miles every day. I'm gonna strength train six days a week. I'm gonna eat nothing but salads. I'm gonna blah, 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 blah. You should have been doing that all before, but not that extreme. Like pick a few things like, okay, I'm just gonna walk. And then what that does is it builds up a baseline of discipline. And then once that becomes easy, an analogy for that is concrete. You lay that out once the concrete gets solidified and then you put a little bit more on it. But you have to wait for the concrete to get solidified and that takes time. So you have to walk for months and be like, oh, that's easy. It's just part of, it's a habit. It's like putting a seatbelt on. It's like looking both ways. It's like coming to a stop at a red light. You don't think about it, you just do it. And that's the same concept with walking. That solidifies, becomes concrete. And then you're like, okay, well, I'm gonna uh, be hydrated and walk every day. And then boom, boom, you add that up, boom. And it's, you guys can figure out the rest. You just keep building up, but you don't build, you don't build a house all at once. You put the concrete down, then you put the frame, then you put the drywall or sheetrock, or you put the insulation in the drywall and sheetrock. But you get my point. Don't make crazy drastic changes. Make small, subtle changes immediately. It should be done. It doesn't matter what time of year it is. It's totally pointless. It's just an arbitrary thing. It's just a you know, whatever, it's nothing. Just start today. Doesn't matter what day it is. So I wish you guys health, longevity, and strength, and I hope you guys have a great day. And I hope this helps.